Mm-hmm. Um, it's because it was under tension. If you don't make it under tension, it will never move forward. So um, I think it's a good analogy for our life. And one thing that I've realized whenever I travel, I really only have myself to rely on, whether I'm going down a dark alley and no one has my location, I don't have Wi-Fi for WhatsApp, mm-hmm. or um, I need cash, whatever it is. Um, and I've been in situations where, you know, my bills were too high for the income that I had. I've been in situations where um, I made an investment and immediately regretted it, <laughs> you know, and different, different situations like that, or I've made like, you know, donations that were way above what I expected. And it was just a decision I made in the moment and then immediately fear and you have to act fast. But I think that creativity, growth, uh, progress is all in that, um, that realm where you're stretching yourself beyond where you previously had been stretching yourself. So what we're going to do, Christian, we're going to keep it, this thing's going to be a little bit more, it's going to go back and forth. So like examples of stretching, let me hear one from you first. What's an example of, of making it so you're going to stretch and I'm going to give you, okay, actually, before you do that, people, right? I'm in a, I'm in a garage, right? A car garage. Uh-huh. Right? And I see people getting in their cars. I don't know their situations at home. I don't know how things are at home. But I see these cars and it's, there's no problem with it. They're just kind of subpar, right? They're not, they're not great cars. And I think to myself, dude, there's people I know in this garage who are doing way better, but they're, they're thinking so analytically and like logistically about their, <laughs> about what they're buying, mm-hmm. um, that they're never going to get to that point where they feel comfortable based off their numbers to get something they really want. Right. Do you know what I'm saying by that? Are you getting the example I'm kind of giving you? Oh, a thousand percent. Like right. what Bob Proctor says, he says, don't have an A type goal. He says, don't have an A type goal, what you know you can do. Don't have a B type goal, what you think you can do. Have a C type goal, the fantasy goal of what you um, what you want, what you really want. 